Welcome back. My name is Stephanie. If you're new here, thanks for visiting us in our little blessed nest. Today, I've got some random things for you guys to watch. I stopped by Aldi's um, a couple of days ago. I have on the same shirt. That's because I live in this thing now. I got it at Goodwill and it's super comfy. Oh, back up. Let me get back on track. So I took some footage at Aldi the other day when I went in there to pick up some stuff because they had some really cute Christmas items that I thought you guys might like as well. So I'm going to show you that. If you see something you like, maybe you'll be able to go pick it up for your home. I also have some clips from where my mom and I went into Target and went through the dollar spot to see if we could find any kind of Christmas decor that we liked. I did pick up a few things. I'll show you those at the end of the video. I dropped Timmy off earlier and now I'm going to run in Aldi. I have a few things to pick up. So they have an aisle full of Christmas stuff and they have some cute things here. I'm going to show you what they have. This is neat. Make little pancakes with little Christmas things on them. How cute. I always like looking down this aisle at Aldi's. They always have some cute seasonal things that you don't see everywhere else. They had some pajamas for kids. They even had pajamas for dogs, which were really cute. Um, I almost picked up some for Bonnie, but she hates wearing clothes, so I didn't think I should waste my money on that. They had these little bathroom sets that were cute with a little soap dispenser and hand towels. They had Santa, a snowman one, and then the one with the gnomes. They also usually have some good candles and melts here, so I did pick up a couple of the wax melts for my warmer. This was a, this said it was a candle, but I don't know where the wick is. Maybe the thing comes off the top. I'm not sure. They also had some Christmas throw blankets down here on the bottom shelf. Looks like a nice little selection for $5.99. Apparently gnomes, decorating with gnomes must be a big thing this season because everywhere I go I see tons of gnomes. These were little candle holders for $8.99. I really liked these little signs, especially this one with the little gingerbread man that said, Oh snap, and his little arm snapped off. That's just wrong. <laughs> but they were only $3.99, so that's a good deal. These little Christmas village what do you, I don't know what you call them, little shops. They were so cute. It lights up. Look how cute that is. This one was broken though, and they didn't have another one like it. I might have bought it um, if it hadn't have been broken. I just think it's so pretty. They're decorating the tree, and she's getting, I guess she's paying for the tree there, but the little boy was broken, and that's the only one they had like this, as I said. I didn't think this one was as cute as the other one. If you're looking for a few unique pieces to decorate with, I do suggest looking at all these. It's definitely worth checking out. They had a lot of cute things, I thought. Um, they had some Santa mugs. I really enjoy collecting these. I didn't particularly love this set, though. I don't know. The, the painting on it, I don't know. I didn't like that red lip, I guess is what it is. I don't know. There was just something about it that I didn't really like, so I didn't pick them up. They had a lot of things that light up. I noticed that. I thought this was a cute little, I guess it's a cookie jar with a little tree on top and the little tree lights up. If you're into the gnome decor, these were really cute. The little hat is a Christmas tree and it lights up. I think it's a cookie jar as well. Um, and they have these little gnome and red truck trees. This was a really pretty um, wreath, I thought, for $8.99. I guess it's meant to put on the back of your chair or you could use it wherever you want. And this is a sweet little sign that you can put on your mantle to count down the days till Christmas. It lights up as well. The little stars do. They had this cute adult and child apron set with the little candy canes on it. That is really sweet. So 
Some of you had some questions last time about putting the quarter in to get a buggy. They do this to save money so they don't have to pay somebody to collect the cart. You gonna go get it? You ready? One, two, three. Okay, I'm back home. I didn't pick up much at all. These just a few things that we needed. I'll show you what I got. I just picked up some green onions, some salt. We were completely out of salt. Um, I got this cilantro lime seasoned chicken breast, some olives, marinara sauce i heard they have good marinara sauce but i haven't tried it i uh, picked up some milk sweet cream butter some prosciutto some flavor packs i got a lemonade and a fruit punch these candles smelt really good it's peppermint bark so i thought these would make a good christmas gift got two of those and then i just picked up some eggs Eggs were like $3.09 a dozen. That's crazy. What are you doing in there? <laughs> You're so silly. You're so silly. <laughs> Where's your kitty cat? Where's your kitty cat? She's so sweet. She's so sweet. Yeah. 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 Huh? Have you been a good girl while I was gone? Have you been keeping Remy in line? I keep Remy's cat food in these storage things here, and as soon as he hears it rattles a little bit, rat, rattle? As soon as he hears it rattle a little bit, he comes running, galloping like a horse. <laughs> So funny. Are you hungry? Huh? Are you hungry? Here you go. Here you go. Man, this floor is dirty. Yeety. Do your job, girlfriend. My house is a mess. I'm working on so many different projects. I ordered a new bed frame um, for the bed in the office because this twin it's like a platform bed that I have. It's too big for the mattress. It's like an extra large twin. And my mattress is just a regular twin. So I ordered a new frame. And I gotta get that put together. I gotta get the house clean. I'm working on a video. And all the things, y'all. And I have no motivation. <laughs> Hi, friends. We are off today to take my mom out to lunch for her birthday at the Spaghetti Factory. No, the Cheesecake Factory. It was a factory of some sort. Look, I had these Christmas plates sitting on the um, on the island, and I had them stacked up. And I come in there, and they was like one at each seat. And I said, "Are you setting the table?" He said, "I'm hoping somebody will put something on them." <laughs> <laughs> How's that strawberry cheesecake for you? <laughs> made a good dent in it. Think you're gonna finish it? Why? Okay. You can. Take it with me. <laughs> That's about five bites or five bites. We just stopped in at Target really quick just to see if we can find something in the dollar spot for Christmas decorations. North Pole blend hot cocoa served here. If you're into the buffalo plaid and doing a hot cocoa bar, this little banner here would be really cute. They also had this little gingerbread banner, which was really cute as well for $3. I really liked these little trays here on the bottom. How sweet would it be to like stack different kinds of cookies in there, maybe for some sort of Christmas party. Maybe even have some milk bottles with some different kinds of milk in it. That would be really fun for a little party. They had a bunch of these little trees. They had green, brown, and white ones. I kind of like the white ones, but then there were five bucks, which I thought maybe they should be like three bucks would make more sense. And they had these little trees with the snow in them, some reindeer buckets, and these little signs. It was a three pack for five dollars. Then they had some more little trees over here. I really like these little bottle brush trees. I thought they were cute for five dollars. They had a good selection of different things, to banners, pictures, all sorts of little trees. And if you are in the market for some holiday novelty toilet paper, this is the place to be. 
They had these little trees for $5 that might be cute in a little kid's room. I don't think I would use those balls, though. Maybe get some ornaments that don't have the little hooks on them. Um, these little trees light up. I believe these were $5 as well. I thought these were really cute. And then they had these little picks. I thought these were really pretty. Um, they were $3, which wasn't too bad. The little pine cones in them. Looks like it has some snow on it. They also had the berries for $3. I thought you could make a nice little arrangement with those. A little red container with a little twine around it. These are really cute and they're five bucks. They had some more bins with the bottle brush trees in there. If you're doing the hot cocoa bar, these little jars would be really cute to put your cocoa in, maybe some mini marshmallows. All right, so I gotta get to working on finishing up this video that I'm editing because this is the one that you're seeing today. It's Sunday. Just a little bit behind. Well, welcome, friends. Hope you had a wonderful Thanksgiving. And uh, this is the per perfect song, in my opinion. I hope you think it is, too, to kick off the Christmas season. Would you like to know what the title is? Sure. What is it? Silent Night. Silent Night. We're but going I, in with the Christmas carols, are we? But I, Oh, yes. Yeah, so one of my favorites. Um, if I'm not mistaken, that's the first song I ever learned to play on the piano. Oh, yeah? Was uh, Silent Night. Alright, well, let's hear it. Bonnie, you gonna sing along today? Are you gonna sing along? You wanna sing along? Huh? Do you know this one? Silent Night Holy Night All is calm All Well, friends, come on back next week and we'll sing another song together. And remember, the reason for the season, amen, is Jesus. I wanted to show you guys these cute little things I picked up at Target. I picked up two of these little Christmas trees, and if you remember in the video, they do light up. And then I picked up one of these little pine cone and berry arrangements. I thought this would be cute on my kitchen shelf. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this video. I've got to get it edited and posted for you guys because this is today. Like, this is Sunday. I'm finishing up this video. I wanted you guys to have one to watch today, even though I didn't really get a lot of time to record this week. I got some things that I thought you might find interesting. My Christmas hutch decor video should go up this week. It should be up in the next few days, I hope. After that video, my next one should be uh, my tree decorating video. Um, I've been talking with some of you in the comments about me being concerned with Remy. Um, he's a climber. He's into everything. I'm just hoping. Uh, <laughs> I'm hoping, but at the same time I say that I'm hoping, I really am not expecting him to stay out of this tree. So, I don't really know what I'm going to do about it. I've gotten lots of suggestions from you guys. I'm going to try every one of them until I find one that works. <laughs> Hopefully one of them will work. <laughs> As always, thank you guys so much for watching and visiting with me. I appreciate you all so much. See you guys in the next video.